I'm Kate Warnick, and I'm the artist behind this wood sculpture. I got the idea of making a sculpture by seeing other artists who had made um, sculptures out of driftwood. This one is made entirely out of sticks I found in my yard. Um, I didn't realize it was going to be this elaborate when I first started. I thought literally it was going to be a stick figure. Um, I found the piece um, that goes on the top there that I thought looked like the top line of a horse and that's the piece I started with and then I added legs. Some of the pieces I found just as they were and, and put it on pretty much like um, putting together a puzzle. Um, but some of them I did have to cut to get them to fit. Um, I used um, screws mostly to attach everything together. Um, they are specialty screws that are pretty small so that they didn't crack the wood. Um, and then also carpenter waterproof glue. And then we mounted it here on this um, mound we made in our yard and put spotlights on it and if you notice in one of the pictures that reflects up on the house it looks like the tree of life in the background we thought that was pretty cool we did not place the spotlights in any particular um, area it just happened when we turned uh, looked at them when in the dark I found that um, putting this together was very relaxing. Um, I did not find it frustrating at all um, because I had really no agenda or timeline. It was just um, made up as I went. I think that most people could um, make a sculpture out of sticks. Um, if they just took their time and just um, didn't judge anything and just started putting it to, together. You can see here where we have pounded rebar into the, the mound where we've got the, the horse set and have wired um, its legs to the rebar. Um, the rebar um, is dark enough that it kind of blends in so you don't really see um, the rebar there and um, we have it attached by three of its legs um, because one leg is more um, suspended off the ground as if the horse is trotting. For those that maybe want to create a, a stick sculpture themselves, um, I've included all these photos that are a progression of the process that I went through creating this piece. I get a, a lot of compliments on it. I've actually seen people that were walking down our street stop to admire it. Hope you enjoy and thanks for watching. Thank you.
Well, thanks for being uh, here. And if you like the video, please go ahead and hit the like button. I sure appreciate that. Comments or questions, enter them in below and I'll get to them as quick as I can. And uh, if you like what we're doing, the channel, go ahead and subscribe and click the little bell. It'll notify you when we put up a new video. So thanks for being with me and see you on the next video.